Someone said Luigi is free as something, ASF. Just wait till you see me play, dude. You'll change your mind. Don't worry, I got that chat inter interaction, so if you guys are talking, I will see what you're saying. Make sure to share the stream. This is the first MSM for Ultimate ever. Who will reign victorious? Yo, who do we have up next? We're going to see soon. Who am I maining in Ultimate? <laughs> Luigi, dude. The heck? Of course, Luigi. I really hope these newcomers don't quit after getting 2 0'd. Half of, half of every tournament, all the like, if all the entrants, half of them go zero and two. Yo, ketchup! I knew it was ketchup. Let's see if he's still gonna be in Bowser Jr. He tells the fly. Hold on. All right, gamers, it's time. Yo, we got a commentator? Oh, no, this is not stream. It's all good. Oh, game one, baby. He's left, Bowser Jr. All right, Falco versus Little Mac, baby. So a ketchup versus Bane. Oh, I know Bane. I just didn't recognize him. He's wearing that hoodie. So we know Falco is actually looking a little bit nicer in this game. We haven't seen, I haven't seen too much of Little Mac. He looks to be about the same. He just has a slightly buffed uh, recovery when it comes to this. Super armor, baby. Yo. Yeah, this looks about the same in terms of um, combos from each character. Just everyone's a little bit faster. Now he's gonna recover. You know why? Because he has an increased recovery. He uses air dodge as another mechanic, like another avenue of just getting back to the stage. Nice up smash, dude. And I think the the mechanics of this game may actually benefit Little Mac a lot, considering he can cancel anything into a smash attack out of dash. All right, let's see if we can make it back. Yo. Okay. And he has super armor when he activates those smash attacks. So it kind of doesn't... kind of sets up for some good pressure on stage. Okay. Nice. Yo. Okay. We got these dash... these dash dances. Our fox trot, sorry. Dash dance a little bit faster than that, closer together. Nice dash attack. I like it. Almost catches him. Good fade back. So the nice thing you guys might not know about the side bees, the the illusions from Falco and Fox, they have two distances. If they hold forward, they they glide a little bit farther. Nice F smash. If they hold back, they can actually do a little bit of a shorten with their side B now. It's pretty cool. Can I kind of do a small mix up? They do have a small nerf with their side B. If they side B onto someone's shield. For the most part, they land in front of them. You can place it in a way where you land behind them if you do it right above their shield. But that's, that's some knowledge for you guys. I know a lot of people are new to the mechanics of the game, as is everybody. about even, considering uh, Little Mac can get gimped. KO punch on deck, baby. Okay, that's a nice side B. I like that one. It's good. Okay. Okay.
<laughs> that was a great catch. And yes, the illusions are actually a little bit slower. They have a little bit more startup now compared to their previous iterations. Okay. This is even, dude. Slight lead to Bane right now. And I feel like a lot of players uh, have shown to not be too comfortable with parrying yet. So I think a lot of people try to act out of shield off of a hit now. You can see that a lot. I'm surprised you can go for up. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's not. A, that was sick. That was actually sick. That reverse F smash out of dash. That was epic. Game one goes to Bane. <laughs> that was pretty good. And I can't wait till we have a couple more locals. And we have like this tier list. We have tier lists from so many top players. But I feel like there's going to be people who thought, yes, are you hopping on commentary? Yes. Come here. What's up, dude? How's it going, man? It's going great. You know who we have? Who do we have? Who do we have here? We have... No, you. Here. Yeah, yeah. I was about to say. <laughs> we have Kira Flax joining on the commentary. Let's do this. All right. Dude, Bane plays Ganon in Ultimate, dude. Not going to lie, but um, Ganon has some stuff in this game. He uh, does. His recovery is definitely still lacking, but his neutral game is a lot better. Oh, I agree. I completely agree. He hits like a truck. Oh, like like maybe like a semi truck, dude. Oh my gosh. Choo choo. <laughs> I saw that truck. Right? Oh, no, that what? He yes. catches his job, um, dude. Yeah, his, his. I've noticed his down B is actually a lot better. It uh, has a lot less ending lag and uh, about probably the same starting, uh, mm -hmm. starting time. All right, so <laughs> Bane going in. Uh, on the last game, a little Mac main, so he knows how to make his characters hit like a truck. Definitely. Oh, I completely agree. Um, catch up, um, former Bowser Jr. main. That's what I was seeing, and now he's Falco. I think he did play Falco for a bit in Smash 4, but he was primarily Bowser Jr. So it's a big switch up from here. But I, I, we did see a lot of nerfs, apparently, for Bowser Jr.'s character. This man. <laughs> Two stock lead, a three stock lead. Uh, <laughs> that was definitely early. So with Bane being a little back main and you know focusing on smashes for like primarily for, like as kill moves for his character and how the engine now is you can now cancel smashes out of dashes, that's gonna benefit his playstyle so much. Oh, it's definitely already benefiting his playstyle. Um, Definitely, it, it, with Ganondorf, he was something, somebody that I was worried about when it came to landing smash attacks. Uh, but definitely with that mechanic, it, it makes it a lot easier and actually plausible in this game. I completely agree. Ooh, Yo, catch flame the choke, the down B. Ooh, nice, nice Ke conversion. I think Ketchup is still in this as long as he can find a way of killing really soon. Otherwise... It's not gonna. It's not yes. looking good. As long as uh, that's it. it. That, that range. That's a good range. You gonna go play? 